Hey guys, I just woke up. It's a Saturday morning, but um, my camera died and I don't have the charger for it. It's at my grandparents' house because my camera is my grandfather's camera. But um, I went on Amazon last night and I actually found like a really good deal. So I went ahead and got that camera. So you'll see better quality. So right now I'm recording on my phone. So yay, we'll see how it goes. Um, it should be here Tuesday. So we're only gonna deal with my phone for three days. So yeah, so I just woke up. Um, I need to clean my face because I'm like breaking out so bad. Um, lately I've been using this. The uh, Neutrogena Rapid Clear Stubborn Acne Cleanser, the Maximum Strength. So um, my chin used to break out a lot, and it's like healing up a lot. I just need to get rid of this. I don't know why it's it. It's funny because it, in the mirror it doesn't look like so red. My phone like makes everything like if it's even slightly pink look super red. So yeah. So I'm gonna probably straighten or curl my hair. I haven't done my hair in a long time, so. I'm going to do that, uh, put some makeup on, and then I have to go to the grocery store, and I need to eat breakfast. So I'll probably eat breakfast before I head out. So yeah, just thought I'd uh, update you guys. So, good morning! Yes, so I just finished doing my hair and makeup. Um, it's like 12.30, so I'm going to eat some lunch, and then I'll head out to the grocery store. Yeah. It took two hours to do that, and it's still like frizzy in some parts, so what are you going to do? So yeah, I don't know what was on my lip, but it was really sparkly. Um, yeah, so anyways, I'm gonna go eat probably some like PB&J, something like really quick, and I guess that's kind of healthy. Oh well, we're out of like everything in the fridge and pantry, so I really need to go to the grocery store. Alright, so I'll uh, tune in with you guys later. Hey guys, I just finished lunch and I realized it was not 12 o'clock, it was actually 2 o'clock. So I'm headed to the grocery store right now. Um, figured I could show you what I'm wearing today, so. Of course I gotta rep represent Pikachu. My favorite. And then I just got black leggings on. I actually, um, I asked, I don't know if you guys know who this is, but I follow her. Um, uh, her name's Alex, so I can't remember. <laughs> Learning to be fearless, that's what her name is, uh, on YouTube. And I asked her on Twitter if she uh, could recommend any, like, leggings that were good for, like, plus size women that wouldn't, like, completely get destroyed because my thighs do rub together and they, like, uh, like, I guess the word is pilling, and then they sometimes, like, the stitches come apart and it's just really annoying. So I asked her, you know, what type of leggings she recommended, and she said to go to Target and get the, um, I think they're Champion leggings. Yeah, they're awesome. They're, like, a little pricey, like, for pants that I usually pay for, so, but you're paying for quality, so it's a, so much better. So, yeah, and I'm wearing those, and then I'm wearing my, I don't know if you guys can see. I don't know if that's any better, but <laughs> I'm wearing my Reef of Flops. That uh, I, uh, I got when I worked at a shoe store in Maryland. So yeah, um, I guess I'll talk to you guys maybe in the grocery store. I don't know if I'm comfortable enough talking out in public to the vlog, but, uh, we'll see. We'll see. I'm at Publix right now, and there's so many people here. So, I might have to, like, great people are looking at me. I might have to, like, uh, graveyard girl do this. And <laughs> just like earthworm, but uh, if I find any like somewhat empty aisles, because there's so many people here, um, everybody's staring. Why do people stare? Like, seriously, just go on your way, but uh, yeah, so I'll try to uh, take some footage in here, but um, yeah, so I'm at Publix, which is like my favorite grocery store. I know, um, also, I'm, I'm like just I'm talking about all the people I follow on YouTube, but, uh, Tim and Jen, uh, Tim Tracker, um, that was a big truck, uh, their Publix, like, m like, yells at them for, like, vlogging in there, so, we'll see how it goes. Alright, I'll, uh, I'll see you guys soon. Literally every time I try to vlog, someone is in the aisle with me. Like, as I press play, someone automatically comes down an aisle. 
and then they go like as soon as I hit stop they're like oh we don't need to go down this aisle the hell but I guess this teaches me for trying to vlog on a Saturday at the grocery store but yeah <sighs> sorry that the angle is like wrong but uh I don't feel like flipping it because it's more obvious but yeah but uh, so far I have snap peas, some stuff for the rats, apples, Nutella, orange juice, and here comes somebody, so. so I'm about like halfway done chopping. Um, I got a lot of stuff. Um, I just threw it in there. Usually I like to be organized, especially when I'm like sorting through the bags. So I'm going to sit here in this empty aisle, which I'm 11 aisles. I go down each one to make sure I don't miss anything. And it's crazy. It's madness. Like, look at this. So many people! Yeah, so that's what I got in my cart so far. So yeah. Alright. I will speak to you guys when I get out. Of course, someone's already looking at me. So I just got out of Publix, um, like a cart and a quarter, <laughs> like, worth. The good thing about Publix is, that I guess, if you don't have one near you, because I know we didn't have them up in Maryland, um, they'll actually, like, come out with you, like, before you even ask. They're like, alright, let's go. Like, come on. So I th always think that's really nice. Like, the nicest people work there. Like, I, I don't, meh. This is, like, the fourth Publix I've been to. And they're all pretty nice. This is the nicest one, though, out of all of them. This one, and then I live more towards, like, the beachside area. Yeah, sorry, I just need to start up my car, because it's hot! Welcome to, uh, Florida in winter, which is almost spring. Or it might actually be spring now, so... Yeah, I'm a hot mess right now, and someone wants my parking spot. People won't leave me alone. I hate people. Oh! So yeah, alright. I will, uh, talk to you guys when I get home. Groceries. Fine. You gonna help me put them away? You gonna you gonna help? No. Why does no one help me? I'm at the house all by myself, which I should not say that because that is the great start to a horror movie. Not starring me. No, I don't like horror movies. So yeah. Oh my gosh. Just brought in like so much groceries. Like. So, I'm gonna put those away. I have to get over the dog gate. I just like, I usually just bring them through and put them there, and then the kids and the dad will take them and I'll put them away. But they're not here. They decided to conveniently leave. So, yay! So, alright, I'm gonna put those up. Probably play some video games. I didn't really. Actually, it's a funny story. Uh, th our dryer absolutely sucks, so I was trying to get my laundry done yesterday because I just want to like rip off the band and get it done. Well, since it takes forever for clothes to dry, they just dried, yes, like, I put them in Thursday night and it's Saturday, like, 4 o'clock, and they're done. It's ridiculous, so I'm on part two of laundry. So I'll go put up that. I didn't get to play too much uh, Far Cry yesterday. I played a little bit, which I showed you guys, and then that was it, so I guess I'll play more of that. So yeah, I don't know if you guys can see my hand. I'm so sorry if you guys could have seen my hand in the shop the whole time. That's totally so annoying. So yeah, alright, I'll, I'll update you guys later. Probably tonight. Probably make dinner for myself. Yay. Hey guys, so, um, I just finished all, putting away all the groceries and stuff, and... I am just kind of relaxing upstairs. Uh, I just want to show you some things that I got from the grocery store, like some beauty products, more like cleaning stuff. But uh, I needed, I looked up, I have like really bad dandruff. It's just like so, my scalp is so itchy all the time. 
So I don't know if it's from product buildup because I have curly hair and I have to put a lot of like product in it to keep it from like frizzing up down in the south or what, but it's been so bad. So I saw this because I, I saw that you should use tea tree oil. So I got the, uh, what's it called? OGX brand hydrating tea tree mint conditioner and shampoo. So we'll try that. I'm kind of a little concerned because you're not really supposed to be using alcohol and like chloride and stuff in like with curly hair. So I will we'll give it a shot if it dries my hair out like really bad, which this is hydrating. I don't know why they would put that stuff in there, but uh, we'll see how that goes. I'll let you know. And then um, I got some allergy relief because it is almost allergy, allergy season and I noticed I don't have any in my house and that's not a good thing when you have like really bad allergies, seasonal allergies. And then I got, I used to use this all the time when it first came out and then I stopped using it and then my hair is like, it's been so frizzy so I'm just going to go ahead and you know, try using this again and see how I feel. I honestly don't remember if I liked it or not. So we'll give it a shot, and then I needed more mousse, so I decided to go with my like high school, you know, brand mousse, because that always seemed to work. Like you look at old Facebook pictures, and I'm like, wow, my hair looked really good. Yeah, so we'll we'll, we'll try that. And then um, I've been getting like really bad like razor bumps and stuff, like in areas. So I got this Aveeno um, therapeutic shave gel. It says it helps prevent razor bumps. So I'm hoping it will help with ingrown hairs too. So, because I, I honestly don't use shaving cream when I shave. I just like I use it after I um I shave after I, I like wash out my conditioner. So we'll go ahead and try that too. So, and then the last thing that I'm really curious about is this. Oh, okay, <laughs> I'm gonna be real with you guys for a second. I have been getting the worst facial hair on my chin. Like I can grow better like beard than Jared can at this point. It's it's so embarrassing. So um I went to go have my hair uh or my my face what is that called threading like threaded that hurt so bad that is with my like that is within my top five worst pains I've ever like I worst things I've ever been through. Yeah the pain was so bad I can't even form a sentence just like remembering how bad it was. It was horrible. And of course, I, you know, I asked her to get wax because that lasts a little longer. And I was like, you know, does this hurt? Because she was like pushing me on to getting threaded. Because uh, I, I wanted to get my eyebrows done in, you know, this area. And she's like, oh, have you tried threading? Let's go thread. Like, she didn't even like pull the wax out or anything. It's like, come on. Like, so she started doing, and I asked her, you know, is it, you know, is it painful or, you know, you know, is it going to hurt? I have really sensitive skin. She's like, oh, no, 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 no. You'll be fine. Blah, 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 blah. And then she starts. Oh, my gosh. I think I'd rather give birth. It was so bad. Especially, like, right here. And, like, my chin. Or, not my chin. My, uh, cheeks. Because she did everything. It crapped out. <laughs> I was talking too long. But, yeah, so that was horrible. So, I figured I can try this Sally Hansen Brush-On Hair Remover Cream. Uh, yeah, I'll let you guys know how that goes. I'm going to do it tonight when I wash my face. So, yeah, I'm going to play a couple video games because I said I've, I'm going to do that like five times and I still haven't turned my Xbox on. So I will go do that and I will see you guys later on. Hey guys, so I just ate dinner. Um, I'm just laying in bed. I'm not feeling too great. I don't know if it's from like pushing myself you know, these past couple days, or like what's going on, but uh, yeah, so, I took two Tylenol for the first time in my life, like, I usually only take one, and that kind of like makes me, not necessarily like loopy, but uh, like, it just makes me really tired, like, it's not even Tylenol PM, it's just like regular Tylenol, it just makes me so tired, I guess I'm like really uh, sensitive to like, I guess... Not necessarily drugs, but yeah, pharmaceutical, over-the-counter, I guess. Um, yeah, so, yeah, I'm just super tired, and I don't know if you guys noticed, but I, uh, have my pinky wrapped up.
because I decided that I was going to try to make like little tiny potatoes for lunch because we, we didn't even have bread for PB&J so it's like so the struggle is real guys but uh yeah so I was like puncturing them to throw them in the microwave real quick and then I had what did I eat with that like salad I think I had salad oh yeah I had salad because I tried this new dressing it was like a fruity type of dressing so yeah and then I stabbed my pinky like pretty deep so yeah there's that that hurts like a really bad <laughs> um so yeah I'm just basically like kind of just you know falling asleep my phone's trying to die. No phone, no. You did so well. So yeah, right now I'm watching, uh, show you. Watching Property Brothers. I'm starting from, like, the first episode and working. So I'm gonna watch that. I'm gonna, finally, my clothes are all dry, so I'm gonna go ahead and put those away and then, uh, wash my face and go to bed. So thanks for guys, thanks, blah, 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 blah. Thank you guys so much for, uh, watching and, uh, if you guys like these videos, just comment down below, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye! <laughs>